Welcome to Illuminar Lighting Unboxing. Today we're going to look at the 18 watt clone light and everything that's inside the box first, unbox, and then we're going to go through its features and benefits, show you guys everything in one quick video. So now we're going to do a quick unboxing. This one's pretty simple, no assembly required. So we're going to pop the top. We'll just toss that over here. And you notice you have your two lights right here. Each one of these is 18 watts. You can pull the foam out just like that. One light, two lights. And you'll notice inside here, there's some nice little uh, mounting clips. So you guys can actually mount these right to the ceiling. Couple zip ties. You have your 120 volt power cord and you're ready to go. Super easy, super simple. Get these up on uh, your cloning rack and you're gonna be ready to go. We're gonna do a quick plug-in and show you how these work. So now we're going to show you guys um, the accessories and how these work. So these mounting clips right here have a single mounting hole right there. You can see they have two little cam bolts. This is to make sure you have a snug fit. So when you actually mount this to the ceiling, these will actually fit right around the outside just like this and they snap down. These make sure you have enough tension that they just don't get bumped out. Um, but they are easy removal. If you give a little pull, they'll pull out and they just snap back on. Um, we will also be looking at a couple of other mounting options you guys will have with these. There are some small holes right here on each end. So if you did have another way you want to mount it, uh, you would actually be able to mount it through these holes if you want to string them up or put them up with zip ties, that type of thing. Something to keep in mind, this might be obvious to a lot of people. Here is your female socket. Here is your male socket. You snap it on and then this screw comes on and increases that fit. And you have a nice tight IP67 um, connection there. And this goes right into the wall. Now, what we're gonna do is we wanna connect more of these. So we wanna have two of these side by side. So all I'm gonna do right here is connect this one to that one, make my connection. And this one is just gonna go right here to end the circuit. You don't want any of your open cables to be exposed. So you always wanna make sure you put those caps on all of our LEDs. All of our LEDs do come with end caps and you wanna make sure that those end caps themselves are sealed off before you get your grow going. That way humidity doesn't corrode those connections and you don't have any um, short circuits or anything like that. Okay, so now let's dive into all the specs on this 18 watt clone light set. So uh, this is a 120, 277. It does come with a 120 power cord. Most people in their clone rooms are using 120. If you do want a 240 plug for this light or a 277, you do have to order that separately. These are an IP66 rated fixture. Um, so with this little, uh, plexiglass cover on here. It is actually making this super water resistant. It's going to be really good at preventing moisture in those high humidity clone rooms from actually having this fixture break down prematurely. Um, a couple other things to understand about this light is its beam angle is 120 degrees. So when you're looking at it, it has a really wide beam angle, but its mounting height is designed to be fairly low. You're going to mount these at 18 inches or less and really designed to get really close to those uh, plants um, in really low covered tiered environments. We didn't want to design this so you had to put it up very high or, or anything like that. This is a specific spectrum designed to increase root development and that's really critical in your clone stages as you guys know. So this is not one of these just uniform you know grow light spectrums. Um, this is specifically made for clones and that time. <laughs> Some other additional features to know about this fixture is that you can actually hook up a hundred of these daisy chained on a 20 amp breaker. At that point, you're gonna be running about 1800 watts on that single line and a 28 breaker would give you enough um, 
actually amperage to run this with uh, plenty of room not to actually exceed that amps uh, specified or you know code requirements. You never want to over amp it um, and go all the way up to its max potential. You want to stay about 20 or 30 percent below the actual breakers amount. One of the things that makes this really unique and being it's a two bar selection is you can actually move these apart and gauge how much light is required in your garden or in your clone rack. So um, ideally these have about a one foot range at about 12 to uh, six to 12 inches uh, with the way it actually uh, has that light beam. So if you want to add an additional one or you want to spread them apart, um, it gives you that flexibility versus a single bar clone light. So that wraps up everything with the Illuminar LED clone light. This does come with a five year warranty. So along with that 50,000 hour expected lifespan, you're gonna have the peace of mind that this light is going to last. And if there's any issues, you definitely call Illuminar and we'll take care of you. So we wanna thank you for watching this video. Hit that like button. If you wanna see more, subscribe to our videos and set alerts. It'll tell you every time we have a new video coming out on a new product. I wanna thank you guys for joining. We appreciate this. We're gonna catch you next video. I'm gonna go set these up right now.